If you long for the days where you and your black hammer shot infinite sniper rounds at enemies in Destiny, good news, there's a new exotic sniper rifle that you can get in Destiny, the Taken King, that is very, very similar. It's called the Black Spindle, and a lot of people are getting it today uh, because you can find it in the Daily Heroic Story mission. Here's what you want to do. You want to play through the mission as normal uh, until you get through two of the three sealed doors that you have to clear in order to beat the mission. Once you reach this room with the third locked door, don't bother unlocking it. Uh, run towards this hallway with the, the hive lamp in front of it and continue following that, that path. Eventually, you're going to get a warning from your ghost about a fallen distress signal. That means you're on the right track. Uh, just keep following this hallway and you'll find the lift that takes you up to the entrance of the Shadow Thief Strike. Make sure you and your party don't wipe before this point because there are some folks online saying if that happens, then you won't be able to take the lift. After you enter the first room of this strike, you'll have 10 minutes to fight your way to the end. It's basically the same layout as the, the Shadow Thief Strike. You want to make it to the boss room, kill the boss, and all of the ads in the boss room. Unfortunately, most of the enemies here are taken, and there are a lot of ultras, so this challenge is by no means a pushover. I recommend bringing in a full fire team, preferably with everybody over light level 290. Uh, I had a lot of success using a Void-type heavy weapon to take out the ultra taken wizards. And a high impact sniper rifle is really, really helpful for burning down the boss. So you want to try and get to this uh, last room with like six to seven minutes remaining. You're going to need one member of your party just focusing on destroying ads and taking out the taken blights that pop up all around the room. If you don't take those out, you're going to get overwhelmed by ads. The ads by far are the deadliest thing in this room, way more than the boss himself. Have the other two members of your party on either end of this tunnel uh, that you enter in from and just burn the boss. If you see a Taken Blight pop up, help your uh, your ad killer to uh, to burn those down because those can, those can lose you the fight really quickly. We also had a lot of luck with having a defender pop a bubble because it gave us a really nice platform for clearing out ads. Once you've beaten the boss, that's not the end of it. You have to clean up the ads too. Uh, and you need to make sure that you are managing their numbers the whole fight uh, or else you will lose. We, we lost at this stage of the fight after beating the boss four or five times. But if you can finish it in less than 10 minutes, you'll get the 310 exotic sniper rifle, the Black Spindle. It's got the mulligan perk, so if you miss a shot, there's a chance you might uh, get it refunded to you. It's also got White Nail, where if you can get all three bullets in the magazine as precision hits, then it instantly recharges the magazine from your reserves. It's a great weapon. Not only that, uh, it also shows up in your exotic blueprint collection as a 300 version of the Black Spindle, uh, which you can keep rebuying for exotic shards and I think 2500 Glimmer and use that to uh, infuse your other secondary weapons. It's probably going to take you a few tries. It, it took me about six or seven. It's one of the toughest things I've done in Taken King so far. Uh, but uh, with with good teamwork and a little bit of luck, you can uh, you can pull down this awesome new sniper rifle.